Hey everyone, it is Chris Pallone, NBC 13 HD News. It is now uh, approximately 1238, no that's not right. It is now 138 a.m. in Birmingham and I am on the field at the Rose Bowl long after Alabama has won their 13th national championship. It's really been a hell of a night. I don't know if I can say that on TV, but we're not on TV right now. Um, it wasn't the prettiest game I've ever seen, but to Alabama fans, that really doesn't matter. Um, at the end of the day, all they will remember is that they won the national championship, and uh, there will soon be a statue of Nick Saban in front of the uh, Bryant-Denny Stadium. Uh, right here, actually, where I'm standing, I'm right on the three-yard line, right near the uh, Texas end zone. This is where Alabama recovered the fumble in the final four minutes of the game. And then uh, right over here, Mark Ingram punched it in to, uh, to kind of seal the game. And uh, it really, really was quite a special night for Alabama fans. I'm sure it's one they'll never forget. Been 17 years since Alabama last won their last national championship. And I think for people who root for the Crimson Tide, they have to believe that this team is back competing for national championships and at a level of prominence that they once were at. Uh, now they've returned to that place because Nick Saban has got them believing in themselves. He's got players coming in who um, who really, really believe in his program. They're talented players, and they believe that Alabama should be an elite team. Uh, we've got some editing to do for the morning show, and we'll have full coverage all day Friday of the um, coaches' news conference, Nick Saban's news conference. That'll be at noon uh, live on NBC 13. And uh, I'm sure we'll have a full wrap up later in the day on Friday. So celebrate Tide fans. Enjoy it. The, uh, the Tide will be coming back into the Tuscaloosa Airport at about 7.15 Friday night. Uh, between 7.15 and 8.15, I'm sure there will be a large crowd there to see them out in the cold. Doesn't matter how cold it is. So we really appreciate all of you watching uh, our coverage on the air, on Twitter, on Facebook. We've tried to cover this national championship in an unprecedented manner and for all of you who are loyal to NBC 13 or, or tried us for the very first time we really appreciate you so uh, we'll have more information coming up for you on Friday but uh, for now I'm going to sign off here from the field at the Rose Bowl uh, really a treat to be able to come out here and uh, see this beautiful facility for the first time ever and um, you know we're walking towards midfield here it was right there that, uh, that that podium was set up. That's where Alabama picked up their national championship trophy. Mark Ingram, your offensive player. And uh, was it Darius who was the defensive? I don't know. I'm so delirious right now. I can't even tell you. But confetti still on the ground. Some technicians um, putting some cables away. And uh, really, really an impressive night here. So, for Don Hawes, Todd Eagle, Chuck Blackwood, uh, Donette Halsey back at the station, everybody else who helped out, we appreciate you watching, and uh, we'll have more for you on Friday. All right? Take it easy, everyone. This is Chris Pallone saying good night.